Lefty Lucy. You gotta manually unscrew. Right, lefty, lefty Lucy. <laughs> They're like, wait, you are. What happens if I turn it right? It won't. You strip the screw. It, it, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm never gonna solve the ancient mysteries of this puzzle box. I strip the screw. The secrets of the universe. I need to unlock the oldie drill <laughs> to like drill into the core of the screw and every. Oh, this is the worst. Guys and welcome to GT Not Live, where true story. A half hour ago, I rolled off of a red eye airplane from LA to here. I got somewhere between I don't know, 15 minutes and three hours of sleep on that flight. I couldn't tell you because I would just go randomly unconscious while correcting and giving notes on scripts. So I would just be like, "Up," oh, and then I'd be like, "Oh, here I am." I don't know how much time has elapsed. So unclear about all of that. I'm running on question mark amount of sleep, and today we are filming a thing that I have no idea because I literally just sat down on the couch. So, uh, Sam, mm. what are we playing today? Today we are playing one of my favorite game series of all time. Real? Is that true? And this is 100% accurate. Wow. Real but and true. Hashtag not for the content, like actually real. Uh, a little bit of both. I mean, I would hope it's for the content. Yeah, of yeah. course. This, like, is, this isn't, you know... Dear Diary, I made Matt play my favorite game of all time. <laughs> and it's and it's terrible for the con. Right, yeah, okay. no, this is a very well-known, very well-received game. Okay. Um, that I, as a longtime viewer of GT Live, have always wanted us to play. Really? Yeah. And uh, we never did. And now that I'm sitting back here, I'm like, why am I wishing? Why yeah. don't I just get the game on you, Steam? You are the puppet master now. I have the strings. I, I Yeah, pull my string. <laughs> pull my string, Sam. Master of puppets. Yeah. <laughs> This was all of 67 cents on Steam. Shout out to Steam Summer Sale. <laughs> wow, 67 cents. Oh, yeah. Man, not all. Wow. Selfish Sam time is budget friendly. I love yeah, this. Yeah, hey, I'm that. a man of the people. Okay? <laughs> Company man right here. We are, we are in a recession right now. CPMs are low. It's, it's been rough these days. Mm. 67 cents sounds right in the pocket. I do what I can. That's good. I mean, that's, that's about 4 million views worth on a short. <laughs> True, true, true story. <laughs> that, is, that, real. Is, that is the CPMs you're like. At, about, at least a million views on shorts. That's 67 cents. So, okay, the, the like three shorts that we filmed last week are going to mm, cover this game. Earn this game back. <laughs> Great. Awesome. So, so, what is the game? Tell me about it. So, uh, this is The Room. <laughs> it is. Or, or The Om. Um, the Om. Um. As, as I see on that's our monitor. The hardcore fans, we call it Om. Um. That's, that's what they call it for short. Yeah. That, that's the abbreviation <laughs> of, the, of the title. Like um. the the noobs call it the room, but if you're yeah. really in the nose, um, um. yeah, speedrunners, oh, yeah, you, you play save off. frames. <laughs> they saved the frames. I IRL saved frames. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, saving frames by removing half the letters by calling it the word that it's not called. Right, um, I'm a speedrunner of um. <laughs> Let's submit this one to Games Done Quick. Be the only one. I speedrun om. Um. So okay, what is this? Uh, this is like a very well made. Escape room type and, puzzle box. Hence the hence the locked door that I'm. Uh. Say, yeah, that, based on the context clues, I'm like, oh, this is gonna be a escape room like puzzle thing, right? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, and you're sure we haven't played this one? Because uh, let me tell you, we have played a fair number of like generically titled puzzler games. I feel like I, I don't recognize this by any means. Mm. So maybe. But also, with a name like The Room, I can't really be sure. Did you check? Yes, based on my control F of the GT Live backlog. I'm, I'm glad that it was in the word room. I'm so glad that you were so <laughs> thorough, Sam. Thank you for that. Man of the people himself. Yeah. All right. So in honor of uh, Sam and his selfish content time, mm -hmm. being the man of the people that he is, uh, let's hop into The Room, or as we cool kids say, um, mm -hmm. uh, let's go. Is there more than one of these? There are four. No way. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. They're all very, very good. So if this goes well, and people in the comments really like it as much as I do, yeah. we've got four more of them to do. Which is probably like a year's so worth of content. Many. I was going to say, <laughs> like knowing how slow we are at playing things, that'll actually be a literal year's worth of content. Oh, That'd yeah. be great. Okay, um, let's arm it up, friends. Woo. I love that you're expecting me to do puzzles in my like sleep-addled yeah. sleep brain. Okay, click and drag the mouse. Look. Oh yeah. Oh, this um, 
So it is an actual puzzle box. That's cool. Double click on the envelope on the top of the safe to use it. Okay. On the top of the safe to focus on it. Okay. So there's this guy. Focus. Slide the letter out of the envelope. Slide. Nice. Oh, good old wax seals. Need mm. more of those in our life. You came. I knew your curiosity would get the better of you. Please excuse the mess. My housekeeper abandoned me shortly after the rest of the world. Hmm. The answers you seek are inside this box, along with something else. Something they said could never be built. It is the only one in... Is it a time machine? Are we unlocking a time machine at the end of this? Uh, time machine, time traveling ball pit? Maybe. Yeah, okay. You can, you, you can say yes. If I'm right. And you can uh, tell me no. If I'm not, I, I don't care about the spoilers. I just want to see if I was able the to. The real answer is I have no idea. You've played the game. <laughs> I was all in have the Have you puzzles. never beaten this game? I've beaten them all. But <laughs> you don't know? I, yet. When I get letters like this, I just click through. Are you kidding me? This was before I was hired here. <laughs> Man, okay. Well, I'm glad that you get to re-experience it knowing the actual game. That right. It is the only one in existence. I love that you don't know. <laughs> and it is the key to incomprehensible power. This safe was constructed to keep it from lesser minds. I have every faith in your solving this mystery. You always were the smart one. Uh, with the enclosed, so potentially a sibling relationship. Uh, with the enclosed key, I gift you one parting favor. Uh, keep the eyepiece with you always. Without it, you are as blind as the rest. The stakes are higher than you could possibly imagine. Signed, A.S. Click the key to collect it. Got it. A small brass key with an animal motif. Cool. All right. Tutorial, rotate the lid to line up the keyhole. Okay, ooh, hey. This kind of appears out of nowhere, cool. Got that. Drag the key into the keyhole. Got him. Turn the key, wee. Open the lid. <laughs> nice, <laughs> awesome. Uh, pick up the eyepiece. A curious eyepiece. Feed me, Seymour, and I shall survive. Give me drink, and I shall die. Click on the eyepiece icon to wear. Okay. Looking stylish. It doesn't do. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> gotcha. Perhaps something's missing. What does the note say? It said, uh, "Click the eyepiece tool to remove the eyepiece." Okay. A riddle. <laughs> ah, yeah. The solution must be here somewhere. Feed me, and I shall survive. Give me drink, and I shall die. Okay. Right click to zoom out. You'll find the answer somewhere on the safe. Okay. Can I open things? This looks like a suspicious hatch. Okay. Wait, oh, oh no! Some, a strangely shaped keyhole. Okay, yes. It does appear to be. Zoom out. Oh, I see fire. And that is the thing that is fire. Wood feeds it, but what? <laughs> I was about to say this, thank you. But okay, thank you, game, for solving this. Fire, wood feeds it, but water puts it out. I guess I shouldn't give it a push. I guess I should give it a push. Got him. Nice. Okay. A peculiar old key. There's something unusual about this key. I should take a closer look. Rotate the end of the key. It looks like I can turn the end to make the key into a different shape. That's cool. Okay. Apparently I can only rotate it thus far. <laughs> so, <laughs> only two options, friend. Uh, that seems like it should apply to this guy, right? We would think. Okay, can I? Oh, I gotta drag it. That's right. Drag and insert. It doesn't fit. The key's the wrong shape. Well, <laughs> let me tell you, I have another option here. Maybe this is the one. There we go. Mm. So I shouldn't have done it in the first place. Hello. Inventory object. It's a bottle opener. An ornately engraved metal plate. The end looks like it be could be used as a wrench or as a bottle opener. Hey. Pshh. Efficiency, two crack, and one. Right, crack and open the Corona. Mm. Uh, what else we got here? Okay, let's zoom out. So we got a wrench. We have earth, fire, wind, water, and heart. We're the planeteers. You can be one too. Because saving our planet is the thing to do. I'm noticing this. Can I look at this lore on the floor? <laughs> I'm noticing lore. My favorite, lore on the floor. Astromica. So, something about astronomy, that's all I got. Let's, let's zoom in here, these look wrenchable. There we go. Ooh, another mysterious keyhole. Mm. And what do we got? Let's see. 
Can I turn these gears? Because there's a giant gear back there. This seems to be missing teeth. Some way, let's look at the bottom. Bottom. Let's not look at the bottom. Really doesn't want me to look at the bottom. Okay, there's water. But we know that's not the correct answer. Uh, it doesn't really seem like there's a whole lot on this side. Oh, now we're back here. Oh, there we go. Uh, bespoke safes for the gentry. Guildford, England, the world-renowned talisman, 1807. Guaranteed thief and fireproof. Yeah, but is it wrench-proof? <laughs> I think not. No. Let's see. Righty-tighty, lefty-loosey. Got him. A lens. It looks like it could fit into an eyepiece. Okay, click the eyepiece icon to wear. Oh! Oh, hello! <laughs> this is, you never want to use this eyepiece at a hotel room. You don't, want to, you don't want to know what you're going to see. It's just a black light. It's, just, it's like, oh no! Too much information! No, thank you! <laughs> okay, we got this. Which appears to be gears or something. Uh, maybe related to the other side. We've got, let's zoom out. Can we zoom out? Not while I'm in eyepiece mode, apparently. This way, let's do this. Okay, we got a lot more satanic ritual markings. Got some wingdings. Definitely posted some wingdings on there. Mm -hmm. Can I go, Ooh. No. What else we got? Oh, here we go. Here's this thing. So can I turn it? Or what? Can I turn you? Because you look like you have that same ship's wheel thing going on. But you do not. Okay. Hey, key. Do you fit into this keyhole? I know you have a secondary form. Let's turn you and see. Yeah, you do. Excellent. <laughs> Just what we were looking the for. The best. Uh, we're, I'm really big into puzzles. Go figure. This is a shock to everyone uh, known to mankind. What? Matt Pat likes puzzles. Get out of here. No. Uh, and I've noticed that there's this trend of, like, similar colored puzzles, or, like, basically it would be that series of gold rings and they're concentric circles, but they're all, like, one color, and that's what... They're, they're called, like, the vault puzzles or something like that, hmm. that are very reminiscent and supposed to be kind of, like, tricky that way. Um, but this is very reminiscent of one of those. Okay, so let's do... Can I rotate you at all? Yes, I can. Okay. Which wheels can I rotate? I can rotate you, I can rotate you, and I can't rotate the middle. So that means I'm gonna have to line you up like this, and then like this. And then, like, this looks, this looks pretty good. Nope, not. Um, one more. Like this, there, ah, uh, nope, definitely not. Like, no, I was right. This one. Right? No? Was I wrong with my second one? Oh, I'm wrong with the second one. Duh, come on, Matt. There we go. That's better. Mm. And then we go here. There it is. That's beautiful. That was better. Pay attention to the details. Okay. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'll do my own sound effects. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Thanks, we ladies don't need and gentlemen. Game audio. Well, well, let's take it out for a closer look. <laughs> Chapter complete. GG. Done. Teams nice. Four of them. Um, speed run. <laughs> Pleasing progress. 80%. But do you really think that you've proven yourself yet? Yeah, yeah, I do. I think I've. I think I've. My work here is done. Rank let's one. Let's um, runner. Yeah, <laughs> that was a PB right there. <laughs> Real. There was a there was a lot of uh, secret messages in the background that my lens revealed that we ended up not using mm. just calling out there there was paperwork on the i feel like we're leaving lore behind here saying. i would agree with that yeah these three three these three seals stand or or between me and the contents of this box <laughs> damn seals get up maybe i feed them a fish that's right that's what happens when you get a half hour of sleep matt bat okay these three seals it's locked up tight there must be a way to get into it okay let's check it out but apparently not that way. Here we go. Activate lens. Ooh. Oh, 
Oh, got a little finger, little fingerprinties right here. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello, secret book. Inventory object found, an ancient leather-bound book. The cover seems very ornate. Excellent, thank you. Ooh, hey, and there's secret key right there. And that's what I got. Interesting, good to know. What do we got with this guy? Cover seem, the cover does seem very ornate, let's see. It's a very fancy book. It is. I go here, then here. Nice. Okay, on uh, February 11th, my research continues as a, at a snail's pace. With these barbaric instruments, I can barely read anything at all. With my barbaric distance from the screen, <laughs> yeah. it's also equally a struggle, I gotta say. I'm uh, just as close as you are, and right? I can't read it. <laughs> But there's something there, between earth and fire, between water and air, the four nations. <laughs> Taken over by the Fire Lord Ozai. I cannot see it, but I can see its presence. Okay, so between earth and fire, between water and air. Okay, earth and fire, water and air. Uh, I cannot see it, but I can see its presence. Uh, like the shadow of the object without substance, yet betraying the shape and form of that which casts it. It is the final element, null. It brings meaning to the rest. It's the avatar spirit. It brings meaning to the rest just as all the numbers of the world are meaningless without their zero. The circle are pretty fool. The circle are petty fools, blinded by their dark arts and their greed. Alchemy is not the pursuit of uh, Kalo Gold. It is the pursuit of this. 117. A key, it looks like it's for winding up clockwork. Anything on the back of the book? No. Okay. So between earth, fire, wind, water, and heart is what we're looking for. We got this key. Anything interesting about this guy? Nope. Not particularly. Okay. Great. And we still got this guy. All right. Zoom out. Zoom in. <laughs> A circular indentation. It seems to connect to the mechanism inside. This does look like it could fit. Perhaps not, though. Hmm. I do. It had a square hole. I'm just saying. Yeah, that would have been my instinct. Right, well. and, and you're not gonna fit there. Okay. How about I wear this? Woo! Ooh, hello, hello, weird number box, floating around in there. What do we got? We got a got a five. That's cool. I like this. Got a five. We got a like a two. Right there. We got zero. Another five. Got stuff on the bottom. Hmm, hello, more keys. What is this? That is a... What number are you, friends? This is cool. I like this little perspective puzzle. Yeah, this is a good one. Yeah, this, this is, is very, uh, like, super liminal. Right, oh yeah, absolutely. Good, good reference. Yep. What a great game. Okay, so here, we'll come back to that. What's this down the top? This looks suspicious. Hmm. So there's a lot of these four dashes and a symbol there. So this one has kind of this this one. The other one has the kind of keyhole symbol from earlier. Star. A star-shaped indentation. Yes, thank you. <laughs> and then this. You, you, you call out nothing about this, but this is very clearly important. Well, it's not a star-shaped indentation. I mean, it certainly isn't, but very clearly it is an important indentation of some form. Uh, what else do we got? What else can I put in here? So I've got this guy. Oh, this, in fact, might be my number code, so I might have to come back to that, huh? Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. Ooh, hello. Hello, thing down in the bottom of this box, maybe. Can I see you? Hey! Wow. Ooh! -hoo -hoo! Super sneaky. A short piece of cotton... It smells of paraffin wax. Okay. Gonna have to light that puppy on fire at some point to potentially unlock something. Or is it going to be used in... Oh, we got all-seeing eye. A plate with an eye symbol on it. Doesn't seem to move. <laughs> staring right back <laughs> at you, buddo! Got him staring contest. Seems to relate to that. Uh, just out of curiosity. I've had my fair share of 
hey, shove the paraffin wax candle into the keyhole puzzles. That's a classic solution. Cl- classic. Not in this case, though, apparently. Uh, we got a word up top. Good to know. Is that something up there? No, it's just giving me a weird look. Here, what type of code are you? Oh, here we go. So this is going to be this guy. So we know that this one is this. And I believe this one was this guy, if I remember correctly. Because he was in here. Yeah, so he was the swirly swirly gig. The religious swirly gig with his cross on the top. Great. Mm-hmm. So now we got to find the other two, which I have not seen yet. So let's keep... Oh, wait. <laughs> Except there's one right there. <laughs> Go figure right there. We got uh, the old double cross. Double cross in the corner. Uh, where are you at? Double cross. No. Nope. Double cross in the corner. All right. So we don't know that bottom one. I could just brute force it, but I don't like doing that. Mm-hmm. That's, that's integrity, right? Yeah, there. that's right. I respect it. Thank you. Can't shove it in there either. <laughs> you really want to I just, put that I just want to shove my wax there. somewhere. Sometimes you just want to shove your wax around. <laughs> uh, sometimes you just got to stick your wax in places it doesn't belong. Uh, okay, what do we got here? Oh, hey, here's the last one. Uh, so it looks like big, big, uh, big neck stick bug, clearly. <laughs> Big necked stick bug is clearly what we're going for here. There's big neck stick bug, to which we get a heavy cast iron key. Whoa. That is a big heavy key, isn't it? What do you look like on the top? Do I have anywhere I can put you right now? I don't really think so. You don't really resemble anything that I recognize quite just yet. And there's no secrets there yet, okay. Yeah, you're too big for this, so this is where we're headed to next. Let's play this game, shall we? So we got a 7 on this side, for sure. Got a 5 on this side. Got a... You got a... Got got a (laughs) something on the bottom. Got a... 2... Got a five, two, seven. And on the top, five, two, seven. It feels like that's going to be a six. <laughs> Weirdo question mark. <laughs> Backward six. <laughs> like five, two, seven, six, maybe? Let's see. What do we got? Oh, it's on the side, actually. So this was the five. This was the seven. This was two. Six. No. Incorrect. What are you on the top? Heart. Stan. (laughs) Can I input Stan? No, not so much. Okay, as I look up to the top. Right? All the other ones are, like, really obvious when you look at them. Like, this one is, like, that is very clearly a 5. That is very clearly a 7. This one is not very clearly something. But if I zoom out, maybe? No? So that's a 2. I'm going to say that's a 2 on top. That The other ones feel too broken. I think it's 2 on top. And then the bottom... Okay, well, we know that this is going to be two. We're going to go two on top. And the bottom, then, is going to be what? Not seven. Two. That does feel like a completed two. It's a very squished two. It is a very squished two, though. You're right. Oh, six. That's a good six. Mm -hmm. I'd say that's a pretty solid six. Yeah, there we go. Nailed it. I will take that. Flip your switch. Ooh, hello. And what do we have here? Not a whole lot for me to look at is what that is. Can we zoom in? What's up here? Oh, from my buddy AS. More lore. 
February 11th. Uh, Sam would skip this normally. Uh, my research continues at a snail's pace. <laughs> With these barbaric instruments, I can barely read anything at all, but there is something... Hey, wait a minute. I already read it then. <laughs> I, already, I already read this one time. I don't need it again. It's the same It's the exact same thing. <laughs> no you, wonder I skipped that. <laughs> right? I'm going to start skipping lore at this point. You read one, you read them all. Right? Like, get out of here, man. I already read this. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, did you did you read my did you read my diary? Because if you didn't read my diary, I'm gonna force you to read it again. That is awesome. That's hilarious. Well, poop. I was all excited about more lore. You are a suspicious door. Can I open you? I see your hinges. Push it in. Push it out. No. Okay. Not quite. What else? What else do you do? What else can I zoom in on here? Ooh, what was that? Is that a lighter? Yeah, okay, so we're gonna do wax here. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm gonna just shove that one up there. All right, we're just, we're just gonna roll with it. We're, get, we're gonna let it roll. Yep, it is there. Doing its thing. And now we're going to what exactly? Uh, let's see. We have a, a warm, glowing thing burning in here. And you see it also over here. So it feels like it should be projecting something here. I just need a way to turn or clean the wheel or something. Because this looks like a movie projection wheel, right? Yes. Yes, it does. Thank you. So we need a way. This doesn't really look like it fits anything. Only when zoomed in. This doesn't feel like it's fitting anything. I'm just gonna. <laughs> no, certainly not. And certainly not. Okay. Where else can, is there anything else that this guy can go into? Not really. I can't pop you out. I feel like I need either a screwdriver or something with you. And this guy is an opening for me. All right, we'll be back. This is unusual. Yeah, oh, there it is. There it is. Ooh, what's this? It looks like a miniature telescope. <laughs> what is this, a <laughs> telescope for ants? It needs to be at least three times bigger than this. <laughs> Aha! Whoa. Well, it's getting bigger now. At least three times bigger. It's bigger on the inside. And now what do we do with you? Can I get rid of your little lens there? No. Uh, telescope. Can I use you? Nope. Where should I drag you to? Oh, about to this little thing that looks like it's... Oh, only when zoomed in. Yes, thank you. You look like a thing that could hold a telescope. Yeah! Mm. Let there be light! There's nothing to see, see until I get this contraption working. Okay, but hey, we at least know one step closer there. Yeah. What are we missing right now? There's heart. It's a four-letter word. Oh, hey, there we go. What are you? Yeah, there, oh, there it is. And there's the clockwork mechanism, if I've ever seen one. It's always something small and stupid like that. that right, just always. hangs people up. Right, it's not even a puzzle. It's literally no, like, latch. what is the, th yeah, it's, it's like the latch or like the one secret thing. Okay, here we go. Oh, get the feeling there's more to that than I saw. Would the eyepiece reveal anything? Let's, let's double check. Trial. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> In it, case we couldn't see it. it. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> Trial. Oh, hello. Whoa. Right? In case, in case it wasn't obvious, 
There's a word above my head. <laughs> Did you happen to see that word above my head? If not, I can help. Yeah, that I wrote on the wall in a black light image. Is this? No. No. There. No. I like that they're like, we really liked this puzzle the first time we gave it to you. Right. So we're giving you another one of those puzzles. Okay, this one, this guy. Uh, let's see, that lines up. That lines up, that lines up, that lines up. Yeah, this is right, okay. Next. That looks pretty good, and... No, you not not agreeing with me on that one? <laughs> I feel like that was pretty solid. It looks pretty good. I was going to say, I feel like this is pretty solid there, game. Okay. You're, you beg to disagree. Okay, that one's definitely not right. This one. Great. There it <laughs> there, is. There's, there it is. That's the last one with the L. letter L. I wonder what we could use it for. Trial. <laughs> <laughs> Very subtle. T R I. No. T R I. There we go. Ooh! <laughs> no, you're taking away my, my fun zoetrope. The Get movie. out of here. Ooh, we got the eyeball unlocked. One seal open, two more, and I'll be in. Still have a multitude of keys here. Mm. Oh, sign me up. Wait a minute. Oh, yes. Can I? Yes. Okay. Activate key. Activate key. Really? That that's a fake out. Uh, that looks like it's gotta go in there. Right, it's, it's gotta go in there, right? Activate key. No. <laughs> All right, fine game. I'll leave you alone for now, but I'll be back. Let me tell you. Oh, uh -oh. is it the same note again? Is it February eleventh? No. <laughs> Between Earth, Wind, and Fire. <laughs> no, May eighth. We got a new one, but it still says two seven in the bottom corner. I don't know why. McAllister returns with the rubbing from Egypt. The pattern continues. The Tibetans call the null element space. To the Hindus, it's the aether. That's also what it is to Thor the Dark World. And now to the Babylonians, it is simply up. <laughs> the other direction. Not to be confused with down, the mm, mysterious direction. Only up. That sweet, sweet nectar of down. <laughs> The realm of Ishtar, of yet more significance, is the recurring presence of the hexagonal glyph. The same symbol repeated in cultures separated by countless centuries and the span of the globe. Who will tell me now that this is idle superstition at work? When my hands hold the first distilled sample, they will recognize me then. Presently, the skeptics have one more in their number. McAllister has quit my service. Well, on, you McAllister. don't need him. Yeah, he was, he was a toxic friend anyway. Mm -hmm. Get him out of your life. Went on to start uh, McAllister's Deli. Oh, man, and the world is better for it. McAllister's really, yeah, Deli. he found his calling. I, I mean, it's good stuff. It's a safe <laughs> dial, but there is a piece missing. I have, I have a large key. I can provide oh. you with a large key there. That's a this, huge this key. This seems like a uh, significant key here. The right shape, but the hole isn't large enough. There, okay. Knock, 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 knock. Yank. Yank! No. Well, great. Thank you for that. Uh huh. Hello. Here. Nope. Oh, hello. Ooh. Zoom in. Activate zoom in. There we go. Nope. I, I, no, I want to look at this. Nope. I want to look at. Two. Three. And on top, anything good? Oh, yeah, we got another one. Two, three, five. Cool. And hold on, wait, well, okay, wait, while we're here. While we're here, let me, nope, can't read the letter. I feel like the letter would be a good thing where you could hide invisible, <laughs> just saying. Yeah, really. Feels like that would make a lot of sense. How about these little knobs? Anything with these little knobs in the corners? 
doesn't appear to be anything underneath. We're going to say a big old no there. It hasn't changed any other part of the box. Doesn't seem to, at least. So, back to what I should be doing here, I guess. Oh, hey, am I allowed to pull you out now? Am I allowed to... Yank! Pull! Side! So it's that, it's got to be this thing, right? That's your best bet. Okay. Why? Well, I, I feel like I tried clicking on it. I'm like, oh, that's an intro. This, oh, here. Great. Thank you. Great. Great. I'm so glad that that took so darn long. I, I saw it up there, and I felt like I clicked in that area. I will say that is the one thing I'd, I'd fault this for, is there are times where I'm like, I want to go to this side, but I'm not clicking on, like, the predetermined area where they're like, oh, now you may zoom in. Yeah. And so it makes it a little bit hard for me to know, like, oh, am I allowed to engage with this at any given moment in time? 100%. Okay. Interesting. What is this now? I'm going to roll... Okay, so we got a blue guy down there. Ooh, a red. Yellow, red, blue. Yellow, red, blue, and whatever the last color is. Green. Oh. Oh, now you're... I just got to keep flipping you, huh? Is that what we're going for here? <laughs> this is just a... This is just a mini game. Flip the gemstones! Oh, got, got a yellow. <laughs> no, you may not touch it with your fingers. <laughs> you may only awkwardly shimmy the, the third party camera screen. This person in real life is like shaking this box vigorously to try and get these gems to line up. There we go. There's one. Okay. And now there we go. Oh, obviously. Yep. Oh. No, no. I like the hollow. It's very cool. Yeah, it's like a rare Pokemon. <laughs> okay. Right, some super liminal going on right here. Oh yeah. There you go. There it is. Oh, a keyhole. If only we had. A, a huge key? key. A gigantic <laughs> key. The biggest key known to mankind. Turn. Activate. Hey, oh, there man. it is. Latchy Boy's gone. We're cruising. I like that the puzzles I've gotten stuck on the most are not even puzzles. Yeah. They're the, <laughs> hey, find the latch. It's not, And it's not even like the obscure latch of like, ooh, it's hidden into the leg. Or like, ooh, did you see that secret? No, it's literally the one that's just up there that yep. I can't click Attached on. Attached to the box. You don't need your eye. You don't need anything. <laughs> no, it's literally just, did you find the right place to click and click on it enough times? Small cabinet key. Indeed. Indeed, it is a small cabinet key. Could that be you? Nice. Hey! Ooh. An enameled brass star. Oh, I, what, what, if, what, if I, what if I what if I wanted to keep that open, man? And you took my small brass key. The nerve of some puzzle boxes. Come on. Let me keep something for myself. Ooh. Oh. oh. More letters. It's the same one again. No. Between earth and wind and fire and sky. June twenty first. Take note of this date. It is the most significant in human history. I have done it. A human subject was required. The catalyst was my very own being. Fatigued by my studies, I entered the chamber without disabling the mechanism. When I regained consciousness, I had succeeded. The null element is beyond curious, being neither quite energy nor matter. I have already made great strides in its study, specifically in how it refracts the light. Tonight, I open the wine. Whoa. Oh, I'm breaking out the nice stuff. And not like the Trader Joe's wine, not the Trader Giotto's. He's breaking out like mm. the, the ten dollar bottle. I mean, when you discover the null and how it refracts the light, you've got to celebrate. Right, hey, he's, he's doing it, man. A brass ring with the markings around the edge, as well as slam, slam it, pump up the jam, slam a jam, slam. Okay, we'll come back to you. 
I am feeling I'm going to have to figure out what order your things are supposed to be in your little weapons. All right, let's see. We're back to this guy. And we've got this guy. Boop. Okay. So this said, what was it, two, three, five? Two. Two. Three. Five, but it's mirrored. Because the three is on the other side, right? So what's that telling me? Two, five, three? Like if I were to... Two, three, five. What's that trying to tell me? Hmm. Do these have numbers even on them? Two. I see two dots. I see one dot. Let's see what this thing's going to do. I'm just curious. Oh, hello. Okay. No, she didn't want to go that far. Hold up. One. Cool. Great. Mm. Awesome. That was fun. <laughs> that was cool. Uh, two. That, am, I, am, I, am I officially in two here? Two. This is five, four, three. Yeah, this one, two, three, two. Three. And then on the other side, is there five? Hmm. No? Two, five. Yeah, because it, it was flipped around the one. Yep, there is. Great. A large, oddly shaped key. Ooh, they gave it back. Thank goodness. I love that key. Just keep spitting it back out. I can't get rid of this damn thing. <laughs> you can open any lock in the world. <laughs> With its two very distinct shapes, key does not fit. All right, well. we'll just... Ooh! Ooh! Difference. This is like that old Nickelodeon game where the wall comes at you and you need to make the pose. Wasn't that a Japanese game to begin with? I have no idea. I just remember it on Nickelodeon because you get pushed into the slime. That's awesome. I, I, I can't help you with this one here. Is this, is this the keyhole and it's supposed to match the keyhole? Is this what the shape of the keyhole is? is that, yes. yes, it is. Okay, that's, that's nice of them. I do appreciate that they're right. like, hey, here is the keyhole that you're trying to match. Because otherwise, that would be very difficult to just know. I'll yeah, this one's it. got more than two directions it can go. Right. Truly, the sky's the limit. There we go. That looks like a winner. That looks like it. Hey, you weren't there before. Are you playing games? Circular plate with a star emblem as well. Stop it. You keep stealing things away from me, man. So that plate in the middle, was this for anything? Because it was also bopping and jiving a minute ago. I haven't forgotten. I'm just letting you know. I haven't forgotten you. Circular plate with a star in the middle. I don't think this is you, but I'm just going to put you there. Okay. Well, I'm glad I did. <laughs> I didn't think it was you because there's a star in the middle. Second one. One more to go. One seal away. Let's keep going. Speed run on arm. Um. Okay. Uh, oh, I hear a squeak, squeak. Oh wow, lots of lots of gears. So we're missing a gear, a little cog. We need a cog. This guy. Nice. Huge. Whoa! Whoa. It's bigger on the inside. G great. <laughs> oh, that's oh. not a cutscene anymore. <laughs> right? I'm like, oh, am I, am I am I still waiting for this? No. Okay. Uh, let's see. It seems like I need you to match this, right? Okay, so you match this one, so now I need your square one, which is going to go... I see, I, I see you. No, I can't, I can't rotate you from there. That's fine. So presumably this, maybe? 
the blacked out area is the gap. Yeah, cool. So now we need a, what do we need? A triangle and that kind of pentagon thing. Here's the pentagon thing. And pentagon was top? Should have been paying closer attention, I wasn't. No, pentagon is bottom. Pentagon bottom, so that should go there. Boop. And last one is that triangle, which is here. You see this triangle symbol right here. And there it is. Nope. Okay. Oh. It's a ridiculous <laughs> mechanic. <laughs> <laughs> right. There we go. I think that's correct because it was the bottom right. Yes. Oh, no, it's top. Oh, what a fool I was. It's like, hey, you figured out the puzzle, but we're going to make it arbitrarily slightly more difficult for the final one. Ooh. Just for, right? Oh, you're not going to figure out this one. It'd be quicker than that. Yeah. See, this is how they get the speedrunners. That's how you can tell that I still have a little bit of a journey to go with my speedrunning of this game. Mm. I haven't perfected that move just yet. No, you're on your way, though. I'm on my way. Not bad for a first time. Yeah, still on a PB track, for sure. Ooh, got my elastic band and my large cog. Much better than my small cog. Real. All right, here we go. Boop. Nope. Faking you out. Nope. You know what? Okay. okay. All right, I'm going to look at you, cog. I feel, like I, I feel like the game wants me to look at you and look at the way you're connected. And I see that you have, what is that? A hexagon, octagon, septagon. Here, you go there then. There you go. Nice. I see what you want. A small screwdriver. Excellent. We're just making all the gears turn right now. And presumably that's going to be end of that route. So we're going to go over here. Next up, we're going to do screwdriver to this guy. Lefty Lucy. You got to manually unscrew. Right, lefty, lefty Lucy. <laughs> They're like, wait, you are. What happens if I turn it right? It won't. You strip the screw. It, it, <laughs> Oh, I'm never going to solve the ancient mysteries of this puzzle box. I stripped the screw. The secrets of the universe. I need to unlock lost. ye oldie drill to like drill into the core of the screw and everything. Oh, this is the worst. This sucks. Oh, okay. What is that? Oh, wow. A peculiar folding key. Great. <laughs> I like that this side was just like, time your moves correctly, young yeah, that Padawan. Was the, the quick time uh, section over there. <laughs> Uh, okay, folding key. Here, what do you need to look like? A, a key. A, a Minecraft <laughs> character. Oh, uh, it's okay. Just... What are you, what are you, where's this last one? Do I need all of you in place? Probably not. That's not it. Just saying, that's not it. Not it, Bob. Where else could we use that key? Let's see. Also, let's check out the front, just because I'm curious. So I've got this guy. I have an elastic band. Mm. I've got a bunch of gears that are turning over here and aren't turning over there. It's hard to tell what exactly, but something is missing here. Is it the rubber band? <laughs> it shouldn't be. But I'm going to throw it out there anyway because this is a point and click adventure game so you never know okay go to the top check these guys out what do we got up here so we've got our knights he's gold why is the one gold he's holding a mace Axe, nothing, you're missing something, that's the thing. Yeah, we need a gold weapon for you, don't we? Okay. Meanwhile, and out of curiosity, now that everything's stopped, I cannot remove these other cogs, can I? Double them up, you know, just mm. in case. Efficiency sake. Right, hey, I'm done using these, let me just use them in this other area, I cannot. And this guy. Also doesn't really seem to want to move a whole lot. Oh, this button does something though. Moves a cog slightly, but we're not ready for it yet. Good to know. Pendulum needs to move there. 
So all right, fine, I have to figure out this key thing. <sighs> it's basically what I'm, I'm walking away with. Or I could just use my screwdriver and all. Wasn't there another area that needed a screwdriver or no? Am I misremembering? Ooh, oddly shaped indentation, there we go. Let's do that. So that's gonna be this way. Now let's it'll be easier looking at it this way. So this is low high, T, high low, low high, high low. So it's mirrored. Yes, thank you. Oh yes, thank you. Yes, thank you, Lens. <laughs> thank you, Lens. Uh ooh. low high, right? Low high. High low. No, I, I did this wrong. It's the opposite way. Low, high, high, low. Left to right. Thank you, Lens. <laughs> yeah, thank, <laughs> thanks, Lens. Uh, and this guy's on top for sure. Just says low, high. This one's going to be high, low. There it is. There we go. I, I feel good about that one. Boop -boop -boop. Nice. A medium cog. I wonder where that could go. I don't wonder. I know it goes here and it's got a triangle and everything. Feels like I can take this off again. One of the hardest escape room puzzles that we've ever done was they give you a flashlight at the very beginning. Mm -hmm. And later on, there is a thing that you have to insert batteries into. And we're like, where's the batteries? Where's the batteries? And we asked for the clue because we were looking forever. It's like, you all, you've had the batteries the whole time. And it was in the flashlight and you were expected to take the flashlight apart, which I thought was brilliant, except it was the, per we didn't find the flashlight in the room. It was handed to us by the person who was in charge of the room mm. at the beginning. And it's like, no, you broke the logic of the game, right? right? Like if I was meant to take apart the flashlight, it should spawn in the room. Like, it should spawn in the room, right? Yep. It shouldn't be handed to me as like a, you're entering a dark, you, the game starts off dark, so make sure you take this. Yep. Right? That Agreed. And it's small little details like that that make the logic so yep. much different. And it was, and I'm like, that's a brilliant, that was a brilliant thing to think about. Like, oh, I got to take this apart and take the batteries out. Yep. But the way it was delivered wasn't right. And, yeah. and so on one hand, I'm like, oh, kudos to that. But also I was really mad about it. Yep. The game doesn't start until you walk in. Right. Really. Exactly. Like once the, the worker moves, right, that is like is out of the room. Yes. Game start. Yep. Right. Agreed. Hmm. Yes. Thank you. Yep. Do I need one more? You can't reach, can you? Oh, no, you can't reach. And yeah, the uh, oh god, drag. Yeah, you're there, and I can't take any of you guys out, can I? Ah, every time. And you won't reach. I need a bigger cog. I had a bigger cog. I would love to to reuse my bigger cog, please. One larger cog, please. <laughs> no larger cogs for me today. Okay, I'm gonna hold on to those. Just because I can. And you're there. Are you also a screwdriver puzzle? You, there's, it looks like there should be something on the top here. I'm just saying. Just saying. Apparently not, okay. So use that one key. Who needs a rubber band? Is it you, my buddy up here? <laughs> I bestow you the power of <laughs> rubber band elasticity. Here and here. We gotta create a I don't know about that one, Bob. I think any engineer would disagree with this. Right? I right? I I don't know. <laughs> and also, I tried dragging the rubber band over yep. here at one point. So it, for it to oh, it wasn't in the like right area. Very finicky about the, the that's, drop space. I don't know about that. I get it. I don't that's that's a hey, the batteries were in the flashlight the entire <laughs> time style puzzle right there. 
That's what that one is, let me tell ya. Agreed. Ooh, long narrow steel tube. Okay. Uh, let's see. Narrow steel tube. You go in there, I guess. Yeah, because it's not over here. Okay, yep. So I saw you in the pendulum. You either go here or pendulum. Go. Stop the pendulum. Stop. No, apparently not. How about you, Narrow Steel, too? Nope. Okay, hold up. Are you... Where's my bud? gonna give him to you I don't think this is yours but I'm just gonna give it to you just because you look lonely and sad he looks like he needs something. He, he needs something in his life you know he is golden though I know and so eventually I'm gonna get a golden thing and that'll be the thing that unlocks it narrow steel tube and, sorry what did you look like again yeah you're just kind of like a, a clock winder like a clock winding tube. It seems like it should be here. Do I need to stop the clock? Stop the clock! Stop the clock! No, those are just running though, and that's what activated the clock in the first place. I mean, my family had its fair share of grandfather clocks, and it always tended to be, like, that's what the key to wind the grandfather clock looks like. The steel tube or the tiny little hole? The steel tube. Hmm. I'm telling you. I was never a grandfather clock guy. Yeah. It was it was an odd choice for my parents, honestly. <laughs> I'm like, really? Grandfather clock is what we're going for. Okay, that's fine. I mean, it's pretty baller. It is. It's, grandfather clocks are legitimately awesome. Like, they're so cool and the craftsmanship is incredible. Like, yep. they're so awesome. But it was an odd choice for my family who tends to be very, I don't know, particular and very, like, uh, minimalist. In terms of the way we like decorate the house and stuff. Really? Got some kind of smoky. Smoky, actually. It's funny that a lot of the puzzles just come down to it's just a key. Right, just the whole find time. the key. <laughs> what are you doing? What have I done with you in this moment? What have I activated? Aha! Mm. Yeah, using the lens. Okay, so that guy's gotta go down. Where's our, okay, let's see. Oh, geez. Okay. Good perspective puzzle. <laughs> and that's the only way to see it. Ooh. All right, let's see what this is going to be. So there's the bottom. Like there, like there. Okay. Yeah, there. Nice. I'm like, that's pretty good. I'm like, I don't know if you get much better than that. See, when they're like real puzzles, you solve them instantly. <laughs> <laughs> but when it's like, just click on this thing precisely. Clicking on things is hard for me, <laughs> Sam. I gotta admit. I struggle with the clicking on things. A small silver shield. Who wants a small silver shield? You're silver. This is a two-handed weapon. You don't want a shield. But I'm going to give it to you anyway, just so you have it. That's not it. See, but he's gold. That's really not satisfying. But he's gold, <laughs> man. I, I beg to differ. I'm unsatisfied, right? literally. Yeah, try not to get unsatisfied puzzle. Uh, impossible. Right. Oh, oval gemstone. Here we go, oval gemstone. You're going in here. Yeah, beautiful. My At last, my clock is complete. 
Because I'm not. Psych. Fooled you. Uh, oh, hello. Okay. I can move the star. And that's what I can do. <laughs> We have a star with a dot on the bottom. I still got my little tube. And we got an old photograph. Six oh five. Reverse, reverse. Six oh five. Slide to the left. Slide to the right. So this is six. Five is like that. Reverse six oh five. Reverse <laughs> six oh five. This is actually five fifty five. Nope. Rev. I mean, that's the place where we're putting in time. Which tells me. Come on, man, we're so close. We are very close. I feel it, I feel it. I already got you, I already got you and your gemstone. 605, Rev 605. I don't have clock hands, which would have been nice. Be nice to have some clock hands at this moment, but I don't have them. This no longer works. Okay. And nothing else on here moves. This is the thing that moves, and I have a picture. 605, and I have a house. Am I supposed to put that somewhere? Probably not. We still haven't used this part. Can I put up here? Activate Rev 605. <laughs> we did the shield, we did that. I feel like we've done everything else on here. Am I missing the hands of a clock or something? Because it is weird that if this is like, oh, 605. Mm -hmm. It would be a lot easier if there were if I had like things pointing you. Att yeah, attachments. Right. That would work here. Which means I'm clearly missing some pointy objects somewhere, right? Can I steal this? You're kind of a pointy object. You also are a pointy object. No. Mm. But I've opened so many teeny compartments in you. Did your gemstone? Oh, there, there it is. is. There it is. <laughs> okay, there We're it is. We're so close. Right? The lens. I, 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 I gotta stop forgetting about the lens. Six. There it is. There we go. Woo! Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. That was all one chapter? Yep. Oh, I thought each of those was, like, the next chapter. Oh, that was a hefty boy. Yeah, that was a big one. Oh, this is the best 67 cents we've ever spent. I know, right? This is great. The value, baby. That was... That was an hour of content for 67 cents. Yeah. And we're only like, not even halfway through, I'm assuming. Yeah, there's there's a lot more puzzles. That was great. This is awesome. Sam, what a great recommendation.
Thank you. It, it's not going to title or thumbnail well at all. No, it is not. Good luck with that one. You're going to have a grand old time trying to figure out, how do I make a box into it? Mean, I can't wait to see what thumbnails you come up with. I'm already thinking like the classic uh, like silhouetted box, question mark type thing. Like, oh, they don't know what the box is. Oh, what's in the box? Yeah. What's in the box? Exactly. What's in the box? I'll get Nicolas Cage on the thumbnail. Well, we still don't know what's in the box, actually. No, the, the, bo- the box mystery remains. So if you start, if you brand this around what's in the box, it's clickbait. We're just leading them on to the next one. Well, we, we want to know what's in the box. I, I got to keep finding I'm out. I'm not saying I know what's in the box. That's true. Pleasing progress, but do you really think you've proven yourself yet? So really, <laughs> the, the puzzles that I've gotten stuck... I'll tell you what, I've proven myself with, I would say, most of the puzzles. That, that last one, it took me a minute of fiddling around to be like, I forgot about the lens or whatever. I got there. But really, the true puzzle are the latches we forgot along the way. Real. Real. And true. Yeah, the things that we didn't click on that we knew we had. Like, honestly, if you look at the time that we lost and that we probably cut out of this, it's all the just, like, I. it took me a long time to find the one thing to click on. But this is great. I love this. And there's four of these? Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Maybe Sam's selfish time has become MatPat's selfish time. Cause, love it. Because MatPat is going to go and just play these, and we're going to upload them, and People will be like, where's FNAF? And it'll be like, we're playing, we're playing <laughs> real big boy games now. We're playing the room. What's FNAF? Yeah, FNAF, FNAF what? Everyone's here for OM. <laughs> um, it's all about the OM, ladies mm. and gentlemen. So give it up for the OM and give it up for uh, Chapter 2, which we're going to play next time. And it'll still, it'll, <laughs> that one will be even harder to brand because the first one, at least there's a mystery. The second one, you're like, well, more of the box. <laughs> So there you go. Anyway, there's like at least one more of these in store where hopefully we'll be able to finish the whole game. And then hopefully if you guys like it, then we can continue on to two, three, and four because this is a blast for me. Um, So I know it wasn't super exciting, you know, me being like, oh, let me figure this thing out in real time. Maybe next time we can have like witty banter while we solve puzzles. Yeah, it's hard as the person who knows all the answers to the puzzles. Yeah, so we can talk about other random stuff. Okay. We can talk about like your life. Yeah, that's an interesting Your hopes topic. and dreams. <laughs> Your hopes and dreams, Sam. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next episode. And as always, remember, it wasn't a live stream, but it was a video. A video for you. See ya!